And welcome back to All Over the Map. Thanks for tuning in. On this episode, we are going to play World Football Stadiums 2024 on GeoGuessr. It's 400 plus handpicked selection of football slash soccer. Yes, we got to say that because I'm an American. Stadiums around the world. Uh, we're going to get right into this one. And we're going to do this one as a no time of it moving, painting, zooming allowed challenge to play along the link. If you want to play along with us, will be in the description below. And yeah, we're going to explore some football stadiums. We're going to do some stadium games, country stadium games over the next several weeks and months here on all over the map and start to transition some of the stadium games over to all over the pitch. My other channel, the soccer, the football channel, which uh, will have a lot of great con content to come as we build up to the summer uh, European Championships in Copa America. And essentially the reason why I'm doing that channel is the World Cup 2026 in the United States, Canada, and Mexico. I'll be doing probably vlogs, a whole bunch of good stuff for that coming up. So uh, stay tuned for a good channel over there. Go check it out. There's a couple videos over there. All right, first one. Um, first stadium, we've got, where are we here? Atlantsolia. It feels like, I'll be honest, it feels like Iceland. It is that... IS. So I wonder what ground this is here. Pretty large stadium. Would it be the national stadium? Probably not. Uh, let's see if we can get a closer view. FH. UNR Transports. The English pub. There's always an English pub near a football ground. And. Okay. So there's the stadium, Velkommen FH. Here's the club, probably their indoor facility, I would imagine. Um, can we get there? We're going to go around this facility, see what club this is. says Stolfnad. Stolfnad, Iceland. Is that a town? I'm not sure. Not sure where we are, but I'm going to find out where we are here on the map, though, by looking up, uh, hopefully, we get some clues to the streets. Setberg. East here. Viking Village. All right, we're on the forty one. Forty one. All right. Half Nar, half North. Your door, your. Ah, here we are. Here's the 41. Um, two. And then. So we're probably in an area like this. A Taco Bell. Here it is. FH. Kapla. Kapla Kriki. FH. Kapla Kriki. I just got to remember. This is the 41 here, coming into the 40, the roundabout. Um, the petrol station. Yeah, we're in the petrol station here at the corner of the pitch. I think we're right about there. So we got FH, Kapla Kriki. FH, perfect score on this one. FH, Kapla Kriki. Here's the stadium, um, multi-purpose stadium, mostly used for the home stadium of, I don't know really how I pronounce that other than FH, men's football. Um, founded in 1939, that stadium seats 6, 000, or seats 3,000, but the capacity is 6,500, and uh, have won the Icelandic, Icelandic champions eight times there. They played in the Champions League, so yeah. So there we are, most recently, against Rosenborg, 
one of our favorite things, and Sligo Rovers, and Lati. Look at that. Some of you that tuned into the channel. So uh, the current manager is Hammer Godjonsson. Um, is the current manager, and uh, we're going to get to the next round. So yeah, there we are. First round. Second round. We got an interesting stadium here. This is in Korea. Okay, we've got. What is this city? Let me make that out. Ah, Asiad City. Ah, see. Asia. Asia. Um. Wow. Okay. Look at this an interesting little pub or something here, but an interesting stadium. Um. In Korea here, I'm not sure who plays here, but a fairly large stadium, larger than one in Iceland for sure. So let's go off to Korea. Back to start. Uh, there's a walkway up to the stadium here. Let's find out more clues as to where we are here. I know that it says, wait, what is this, a cafe and a pub? Um, Busan. So Busan is where we are. See it right there, I think. Can we make that out? That's what it looks like, metropolitan city here, sports facility. So, yeah, we're probably not right. Ah, oh, there we go, Busan Asia D main stadium. So there we are, World Cup. Okay, so this probably hosts the World Cup, this stadium. Um, I think, let's go back here. Over here, so we are... Uh, just north of this, I think we're right about there. All right, so let's find this one. Let's look this one up, see what this host at Busan. All right, so go back up here, Busan. <clears throat> main stadium. There's the stadium. Oh, it was one of the main venues of the 2002 FIFA World Cup and held the following matches, a 2-2 draw. South Korea, a home match against Poland. I know the United States was in that group. Um, and then France, Uruguay. So there we are, a couple World Cup games. Um, and it's the home venue of Busan e Park, founded in 1979. Owners Hyundai. So look at that. They are currently in the second league. So there we go. Uh, so yes, yeah, so in this game, we'll. Okay, so we're in France here. We'll explore. We'll explore the um, stadiums and we'll explore the clubs and what these stadiums have hosted. But uh, the Stade Abbey the Champ. Um, and we need to find where where are we here? There we are. Auxerre, the Stade Abbey de Champ is where we are in this one. And we are looking northwest. So here we are. Let's go back to start and uh, looking northeast. I think we're right about there. So uh, the Stade Abbe de Champ is where we are for the second round in France. Let's look this one up. Stade Abbe de Champ. I think that's how I'd say it. This is what it looks like on the inside, folks. Pretty nice stadium. Let's see what this is hosted. Who it hosts. It's hosted friendlies, international football matches of France. France and Canada, there you go. Friendly in 2016. France only won 1-0. Interesting. Um, home of Auxerre. Simply known as Auxerre, French football club in league. Well, I'll just say league two for this because my French isn't that great. Uh, the capacity is 18,000. Uh, 541 opened in, look at that, 1918 and renovated in 19. 94 you get to take a quicker some other looks at this the stadium so there we go uh for the 
third round. We get off to the fourth round, and oof, this is going to be tough for me because um, the Cyrillic, that's where I struggle. If you know anything about me in the games, I struggle on the Cyrillic. So what do we have here? Boy Scouts. The Scouts of what? There's a kid with the Boston Celtics hat, which is interesting. Um, all right, so let's look at where we are here. See some flags. Okay, so Armenia is the country because the Ar it looks like the Armenian flag. Unless, hold on, that is not an orange. No, it is not. It is not. It is not. It is. We in Mongolia. Can't make this out. Okay, so this guy. What's this guy looking at? El Trafico. No, that doesn't say El Trafico. That's the derby between LA, the two LA Major League Soccer teams. It said something else. Uh, but we got an information thing here. Not sure really what's going on. Got guys standing up there. Information. Uh, here's about the stadium. Please contact through telephone number 102. Um, Ulaanbaatar is where we are. So we got to find the stadium Ulaanbaatar. A lot of people just hanging around uh, out here. I guess this is probably the national stadium in Mongolia, but uh, not sure. Not sure about this one yet. Interesting makeup of the stadium. A lot of it's brick on the outside. I don't know if we can see on the inside. It doesn't look like it. There's the toilets. Everybody's heading to the toilets. Yeah, so there must be a game here in Ulaanbaatar. So we'll go to Mongolia. And find out where we are. What's the stadium? The UG Arena? Is this it? That's inside. This arena is inside. Okay, the National Sports Stadium. I'm going to guess this is where we are. Because it seems to be... Yeah, I mean, I guess... Well... Deren FC. Are we here? Let's go back to start. All right, looking northeast... Which seems to me make sense because this is where the promenade is. Um, what does this say? Who is? Where are they from? Is that France? Looks like France. I'm not really sure. Anybody know? Let us know in the comments down below. Um, yeah. So I think I think we're right about there. The Mongolian Futsal Association. Um, the Hard Body Fitness Club, but the National Sports Stadium in Mongolia is where we are. So um, let's go back and look up the National Sports Stadium in Mongolia. All right, so let's take a look at this. Yeah, so pretty interesting stadium. The grass looks fairly tall, though, for football. Um, but it's multi-purpose stadium, so there you go. Used mostly for football matches and has a capacity of 12,500. So they got the Nadam Festival, which celebrates Mongolian independence. It's held there every July, which is probably what, what that was, where the world... Well, I don't... Anyway. Um, yeah, so I guess this is... Oh, Deren FC. So there we are since 2008, 16 years ago. Deren Football Club. Um... There we are. So they are, well, I don't know if they still exist. It looks like uh, the Mongolian Premier League, does it still exist? Is it still going? It does. The current season is Darren in. They are their kits. Look at that. Um, so there we are. So the Mongolian Premier League. And we get off to the fifth and final round in world football stadiums. And I want to say this is probably Turkey. Like, this seems like a Turkish stadium, but I could be wrong on this, the way that this is built. Um, probably not. Probably not Turkey. Um, oh, we're on the left side, so no, it can't be Turkey. Probably, like, Kenya, Uganda... Something like this. So, there's tickets. Pretty nice stadium, by the way. I mean, this is a pretty interesting stadium. But I'm trapped in the parking lot, or the car park of this ground. 
I'm definitely going to play the World Football Stadiums again. This is a fun one. Um, enjoy exploring the stadiums from around the world. I love stadiums. Besides maps, I love stadiums. I love sport. I love football. But uh, back when I was a kid, I would uh, actually explore stadiums on maps. And um, I'm not sure where this is. And then also um, draw stadiums. Um, just draw them. Just draw like my own creations for stadiums. So, yeah, so I enjoy this. I could play these types of games all day. The FNB Stadium is where we are. Uh, there's tickets, verification at Ticket Pro. I'm just not sure where we are. Um, the FNB Stadium. Safe City. Well, maybe... Maybe we're in South Africa. I don't know. I'm not sure. I haven't seen any signs anywhere. Okay, so here we go. What is this? Nazrek. Rand Show. Okay. Interesting light. Advertise here. It's an interesting, um, interesting paint around the car. So there we are. All right, so this is like the main entrance, I guess. A lot of ticket booths. Stadium North. New Modern Houses. Savannah City. It's like a nuclear power plant over here. No, it's just impossible. So I wonder if this is another World Cup venue in South Africa. It's past a sign. Baragwanath. Um, yeah, I'm not, I don't think this is Rustenburg. Not sure where this is. Impossible is nothing. Yeah, this was like this has to be like a World Cup venue. Um, and the reason why I say Rustenburg because I know the United States played there. I don't think this is the stadium. It could be though. Let's just take a look. It felt like it was in the middle of nowhere. Um, a good idea to look at this way so I'm gonna go down the road a little bit I'm not gonna go seven and a half kilometers but let's see what this graffiti is it's not a graffiti here <laughs> it's not graffiti it's actually an advertisement that somebody decided to graffiti for funeral homes I guess uh, always interesting um, Okay, I'm going to go down this way. It seems like there's a highway here that I should have paid attention to earlier. And maybe not. Maybe it isn't the Expo Center. Wow, I got... Well, that doesn't work. <laughs> so struggling with this one a little bit. Um, I don't know why I'm thinking like Rustenburg. Nazarek North Station. Okay, so we're not there. this how do 
do we get out of here? How do we get to a main road? That's what I'm trying to find. I know that was a main road over there, but um, yeah, this is taking a little longer than I'd hoped. Joburg. Okay, so the Joburg. All right, so we're going to have to be somewhere out in the area of the FNB. Stadium. Um, okay, so let's let's keep going. We're just gonna go, and if you want to advance forward, please feel free. Don't feel like you've got to watch me go struggle through this. Um, the heck is the Expo Center? Johannesburg, okay. All right. And there we are. There's the FNB Stadium. It pops right up as I was looking for it. And, uh, yeah, nice stadium. The South Africa Hall of Fame. Uh, now we just need to go back to start. We're looking, I guess, east. I guess we're going to be here. <laughs> I just thought about we're heading east and I was looking west. Um, I was thinking we're on the east side of the stadium. That's what happens when you are not paying attention. However, <laughs> uh, that's the story of this channel, the FNB Stadium. Let's look it up. Oh, the opening match of the 2010 FIFA World Cup. Okay, there we go. So that makes sense. So we got a couple. Um, national stadiums, we got a couple World Cup venues here in this game, so this is a pretty good game. We're going to do this one again, but uh, notice this is Soccer City. Okay, so then, okay, there it is. I didn't realize it's so far, so far out of the city, the home of the Kaiser Chiefs. Um, yeah, they're on FIFA and all those uh, play that, the Kaiser Chiefs, I think, the South African football team, the key fixtures. It was the site of Nelson Mandela's first speech in Johannesburg after his release from prison in 1990. And a memorial service. So yeah, this is a big stadium. Um, I guess I just didn't realize. Hadn't seen the outside of it. Always seen the inside. Not that I've seen a lot, but World Cup games, the Africa Cup of Nation 1996. Here are games, uh, Brazil Ivory Coast, and the final between Netherlands and Spain was held there uh, in 2010 and the 2013 African Cup of Nations. You two's played there, and. Most recently, Ava Max Keen, Maroon 5, Imagine Dragons. Um, so there we are. Soccer City for the last round. Yeah, I fell short in this one. We'll play this one again if you've got any requests for stadiums. It could be stadiums of Turkey. It could be Norwegian stadiums. It could be MLS stadiums. It could be stadiums that Messi's played in. Whatever. Let us know in the comments down below. With that said, thanks for tuning in. Until next time, cheers.